it's actually Star Wars. But okay. <laughs> Hi, my name is Alexis Eaton, and I am a junior at Gothenburg High School. She doesn't even go here. And my poem is entitled Symphony of the Waves. The water, like a breaking <coughs> symphony, harmonizes with the beach, a discordant melody reeling me in. I dive. The flute plays in my veins as the waves tickle at my knees. I venture in further, throwing myself above the waves. My laughter chimes over the water. The waves up to my chest, and I hear a clarinet. The woodwind harmonizing with the ocean. I laugh again, not caring to look back to shore. I swim farther, not noticing the danger. I go to plant my feet in the sand, for a large wave heads toward me. It hits and it sends me reeling. Trumpets blare in my veins in panic, and the bass drum of my heart pounds. I open my eyes and immediately regret it. I open my mouth. I try to take a breath, but end up only breathing water. My lungs burn and crash cymbals play, adding accent to the panic of the trumpets. No air. I break free and have enough time to gulp some precious air before I am again drawn under. I find it ironic. My family's nickname for me <coughs> is Fish. If I could breathe, I would laugh. It was funny. Fish don't drown. I was drowning. I break free and gulp precious air, and I see how far I am from the shore. The clamor of instruments in my veins crescendo and reach a great volume. I've drifted. Eyes wide, I see yet another wave, and I pray that I would survive. Waves beat at my back. My head hurts from lack of air and from the power of the waves as they crash into me. I feel calmer, accepting that I may not make it out alive. Another wave hits me and tosses me, and then I feel sand, sweet, precious ground. Hope builds up, and a new energy fills me. I turn and dive into the water with the next wave. I let it carry me back to shore. I stand, and I fall to my knees as exhaustion hits me, the instruments reaching the end of a decrescendo. Another wave. I stumble back to shore. The melody in my veins calms. My bones are heavy. I'm safe. The danger of the waves lingers in my brain. I underestimated the symphony of the waves. The powerful beats of the water seem to say, never again. And I agree. I still obey the call of the water, but never again will I underestimate the waves. <laughs>